Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Right now I have my three little lizards right here, my three baby alligator lizards, because in this video I'm going to be making a, a bigger, newer enclosure for them. And I'm going to tell you how much everything costs at the end, like how much I pay for everything. All the stuff I'm just going to find in our backyard and like stuff like that. Um, right now I'm in the turtle enclosure. I'm going to get these tweezers right here and show you. guys so i got everything that i'm gonna need for this this tub right here will be the base i'm gonna put a top in because i'm drill some holes in it um so this will be like the tank that they're gonna be and it's about maybe like a, a couple 10 gallons uh we have these sticks i just found them in the backyard they had termites in them i'm gonna rinse those off and wipe them down so I've, like three of them because lizards love to climb four of them it's yeah, so, like they're gonna be climbing all over these hiding through them and stuff Obviously, we have a water dish. We have. I'm gonna get another one of those. A rock for sunbathing. Another rock for climbing. They're also gonna use these for um, for like scratching themselves to get to to shed and stuff. That's good for them. We got this sheet moss here for like I don't know decorations and so they can hide under it. And we got the soil for like the base of the bottom. So we're gonna put everything together and show you. Right now, we're just rinsing this out with some water. So like it can like be clean before I put them in and stuff. Um, yeah, so I'll get back to you guys when I start putting everything in. This part isn't really. I mean, you you should do this and to make sure they're like safe and healthy and stuff, and everything's all clean. All right, guys. First, the soil. This bag right here costs about eight eight dollars from um, Home Depot. So we're gonna put this in first. Put it in this thing. Yeah, we just cleaned out, so yeah. yeah. we might need a little bit more. I only added like a quarter of the bag because it already looks pretty full. Oh, we don't need no more. That's good. I'm gonna put a few inches so that they could dig because baby alligator lizards love to dig. Well, at least mine do. So you're gonna pat this down. Let's hold up. And let's move the flakes on the side. I'm gonna add a little bit more just so like have more room to dig and stuff. It's a good arrangement. Right, now that we have the dirt in here, we're gonna add this moss next. So like. It'll be easier to put everything together. I don't have to put this underneath like wood. It'll like just be all yeah, right. So this will add some color and area for them to dig. Here's a piece right here. And yeah, it's all, it's like a puzzle you have to put together. So like you have to find the good places to put them. And I think I have to water this stuff. All right, so we have everything together. That looks pretty good. I think we're gonna smooth out this part because we're gonna put the water bowl right there. We want it to be even. Yeah, so that'll add some color. It'll give them areas to like hide underneath them. And now we're gonna add our sticks. All right, now we're gonna put these sticks in order. They look pretty wet because I just was I just rinsed them off. All right, so this one should go. Oh, should it go like this or should it go like this? Yeah, that looks better. And guys, I haven't named my lizards yet either. So like, if you guys have any names to come up with for them. I'll use those for them. No, that's too high, isn't it? No, it's actually good if I put a top on it, but it's not stable. So we're gonna put this like somewhere like in this corner right here. And this stick right here can go like that. See that stable right there? And it's like walking upwards. And this one can go maybe long ways Ooh, I might have just messed it up yeah that's good that's perfect so look at that guys now right now now after this we're gonna add our stones and our water dish rocks this rock right here this would be like right here Right there. This one could maybe go in the corner or something. Like that. And the big flat one. Uh I shall switch this one. This one goes over here and the flat one goes right here. 
these things coming together now. It's looking more like a enclosure. And this one I'll just put maybe right here in the corner. The water bowl still over here. Ugh. I wanna rinse off and you shouldn't give them you shouldn't give them sink water has a bunch of lead and chemical and stuff in it that you wouldn't want to be drinking or wouldn't want anything to drink. So just give them bottled water. But if you do okay, give them purifier, I just wash this thing. I'm gonna get put some bottled water in there. I'm making this outside, but it's gonna go inside when I'm done. I'm gonna show you all that. So here it is, the enclosure for the lizards. Probably way bigger than it needs to be. For them, they only need like ten. To all right, now I'm just gonna add the water to the bowl, around the bowl. They know it's there. I'm gonna spray down this moss over here. And mostly the entire enclosure. I'm not gonna do this that often, maybe like once a week. Hopefully that's not too much or too little. And let it be like very moist. And here are oh crap. Here are the lizards right here. When you guys do name these things, like you name the turtles, um it should be about like how they're built like this one right here in the front like down there it's missing its tail but it's starting to grow back so maybe and um that one up there that's the that's the biggest one and that one right there it's missing its back leg so make sure when you're naming them think about those things about them so i'm gonna let them into their fresh enclosure Starting to explore. And just like. Yep. This is great. Thank you guys for watching make sure you subscribe so that i can hit 100 subscribers by the end of the year we're almost there we only have like like 16 more to go so like please subscribe and i'll see you guys next time